I don't understand. The tour's over. That's it. Because of me? I'm not going to put you in that situation again, Felicia. I can't ask you to give up your music career because of me. Well, that's not the point here. Well, that's my point. It all happened because of some crazy fans. It's not going to happen again. Please. Frisco, you could call some bodyguards if you need no. help. No. Would you just think about this? Honey, I don't want to live that kind of life. Do you know what it was like for me when I went back to Paris and I found that you were missing? I know it frightened you. Frightened me? My whole life fell apart. Don't you realize that you, you're the most important thing in my life? I want you to have what you want. I do have what I want. You say that now. Why are you making this so difficult? As much as you deny it, I know how much you enjoyed all that danger that you had when you worked on the, the police force and you were with the WSB and you gave that up for me. Exactly. Did you hear what you said? I gave that up for you. No regrets. Well, I'm glad that you gave it up for me because I can't be married to a cop anymore, but I know what your music means to you. Honey. And I can't ask please, you to give up your music, too. I am not giving up my music. I'm just giving up the touring part. Okay? Now, with Terry gone, I'm sure I can get a regular gig at the club. But Terry's gone? Yeah. She got that record deal she's always wanted. She did? Yeah. That's great. There's been a lot of changes since we've been gone. Are you sure this is what you want? I'm very sure. Now, you're very wrong about music being the great passion in my life. There's only one thing that qualifies for that. What? Yo. Now, are we together on this? Forever. <laughs> hey, 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 Robin. Hi, uh, welcome home. Well, Hello. thank you. <laughs> you don't seem very surprised to see us. Well, I knew you were coming. Oh, you did? Yeah. Well, yawn, yawn, yawn. Did you miss us? I sure did. Well, good. Well, your mom's been away. Are, are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. But I'm kind of in a hurry. Oh, you are? Yeah. I see. Well, um... Where are you going? Is there anything that we can do? You don't have time to talk to your favorite godfather? Anything? How have you been? I, well, I'm hungry. What would you like to eat? Uh, how about chili at Kelly's? Chili at Kelly's? Mm. Sounds good. Well, uh, yes, we'd be glad to join you, by the way. Wait for us. I hope you've got money. You said you could give me a boat. Why won't you give me the keys? Uh, and, uh, let's start again. Now, I can't give you a boat unless I get cash up front. Explain cash up front. Well, well that boat's not free, mister. Not free? Someone is using it. Well, have you got the green stuff or not? Where do I get the green stuff? Oh, if this is a joke, you're too late. April Fool's Day was yesterday. Now, uh, I'm kind of busy, so uh, if you don't mind. Where's Colton? Why? The woman there said to see him. Well, I'd be glad to find him for you. But uh, take it from me, uh, Colton's going to give you the same answer. No cash, no boat. You got our boat? Uh, your keys are on the board. Help yourself. Well, if you ever want to write a book, you've got a great thriller there. <laughs> Ruby, we're satisfied just where we are. We're staying home for good now, and we're going to eat here every day. That's for real. Scout's honor. Well, then, that's good news, and I'm glad. Isn't that terrific? Yeah, it's great. I think I'd better get you your chili. You still hungry, kiddo? Yeah? I'm not tired, Why the hell you leave those keys to... Hi. Oh, hi. Uh... Welcome home. Yeah, it's good to be home. Yeah, thanks. How's the boat business? Oh, funny he should ask. Yeah, it's hysterical. You got a problem? Oh, some derelict. I tried to take off with one of our boats, and I took off down the docks after him. He was running like an Olympic runner. Uh, with a set of boat keys? Really? Did you get a look yeah. at him? I might be able to help you look for him. Well, you're a big guy. Uh, dark hair. Uh, 
Well, uh, uh, it's kind of simple, if you ask me. Mind if I join this chase for no, a minute, honey? Ahead. We should probably. Here. Yeah, come on, come on. Here we hmm. go. There's your chair. Oh, that looks good. Mm -hmm. Hmm? There's something wrong, sweetheart. Oh, I don't feel very well. I have to go home. Oh, let me take you home. No, 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 I'll take her. You stay here and wait for Frisco, and I'll run her home. Is there somebody there, sweetheart? Oh, and yeah, I just need a ride. Well, then you've got it. Thank you. Oh, I can do it. No, 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 I need a breather. You just stay here, and somebody wants more coffee. There's plenty there. Come on, sweetheart. I'm going to take you home. I'm going to show you the shortcut, okay? Uh-huh. I'll be delighted to find a new way and a shorter way. Yeah, okay. 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 I'll get you right home, sweetheart. There must be a way to find out where that girl lives. The TV studio was adamant. They won't give out any personal information. Who told you that? Some receptionist? No. I spoke to the head of news department. Now how did you identify yourself? I said I was a freelance writer doing a piece on how young people in Port Charles feel about traditional weddings these days. Mm -hmm. All I wanted was a girl's address that I'll drop her a note to ask for an interview. Resourceful. I thought so. Everyone has a price. Find out who the... Re yeah, find out who the reporter was who covered the story. I did. She's out of town. Keep on it. We'll find a way. She's a very beautiful girl. Hmm? Something very haunting about those eyes.